Welcome. We have here with us today Junaid Yanshet from Vital Signs, probably the first successful Pakistani pop group. Their first album was an absolute hit and they continue to top the charts in Pakistan and around the world. Their hit songs include Dil Dil Pakistan and recently Eitibar and Jeteng Gay. Welcome and thank you for being with us. I know that last night you had a big concert in Atlanta. Mm -hmm. How can, can you talk about it? Yes, um, it was our first time in Atlanta and uh, quite contrary to what I had thought, I had thought that people might not know about us all that much, but it was a pleasant surprise and we had a real ball. I mean, I mean that's the reason why I have a, a, a bad throat right now, because I, I sang so much. How did you become involved with uh, the World Tour 1997? Actually, um, International Arts is uh, one of the, uh, the major um, labels as far as uh, uh, international promoters are concerned. They got in touch with us and then uh, th this is our first comprehensive tour along with three more artists. This time we thought that uh, instead of just touring alone, uh, it would uh, be a good idea if we had three more artists with us. You know, we could have a wider variety of um, audience. and. Um, uh, so I mean that was the basic idea behind it, and we had uh, we had planned uh, a lot of new things which we wanted to do uh, in the U.S. because uh, we had heard so, so many good things about the audience audiences here. What type of music do you play? I would say it's uh, it's world music. I mean I I can't actually just uh, describe it um, in one word. I mean if I was to describe it in one word, I would call it world music. Because right now. Uh, music for music to be successful it, it has to appeal to audiences all around the world I mean you can't just I, I can't just say that my music has to appeal to Pakistanis only and uh, what we do is it's it's basically a blend of East and West Eastern classical with the uh, modern instrumentation that's that's, that's what it is <coughs> uh, your first album completely changed Pakistan's idea of the music scene mm -hmm. How do you feel about your fans? Uh, what is... Eve, it's, it's been 10 years now. I mean, uh, the first time we did Dil Dil Pakistan, which was our first song, and that was uh, August 87. And uh, this is 97. It's going to be 10 years. Uh, it, it, it was a great experience all throughout, though initially we had absolutely no idea where we were heading for. We just came up with music that appealed to us, the music that we that we'd been playing. I mean, before we did the little box, and we used to do these cover tunes from uh, from bands of the West, and uh, and we really had no idea which direction to follow, where to go. But once we did this album, and uh, the way it was received, that just sort of gave us an idea uh, where to go, and um, the rest is history. What is the name of your latest album? The name of my latest album is uh, Nam which in uh, English means your name. Mm -hmm. And uh, it was actually a solo venture that I did, apart from the Vital Signs. And, uh, and Vital Signs are also coming up with a new album, uh, which should be out somewhere in um, August or September. And what are your future projects? Do you, are, you willing, are you going to continue to do the same type of music? Do you pl have plans for any changes? Um, actually, what happens is that uh, I've, I've done about five albums now. Um, you know, you, you, you circumstances and situations and uh, relationships, they play a big part in the way you mold your music, in the way, the direction in which uh, uh, your music goes. Right now, I, uh, I really, really need uh, something to propel me into a direction which is totally different from what I've been doing. I mean, I would like to believe that um, though there are so many new bands coming up in my country, uh, the music that I make would still have a, a, a niche in the society. How do you <coughs> feel when you get such a response like last night in Atlanta where mm -hmm. so many people came in attendance? What is your feeling? What do you feel like when you get on that stage? Obviously, it's a, it's a beautiful feeling. It's, 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 a, it's a kind of uh, high you you cannot get from anywhere else. I mean, it's really, it's really beautiful. 
I mean, the sight of somebody singing your song al along with you is, 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 is really beautiful. But then again, that, that, that altogether puts more pressure on you to come up with something brilliant one more time. Because it's easy to it's easy to make a reputation, but it's it, it takes just a second um, to destroy it totally. So I, I, I think it puts more pressure on you. I know that uh, tonight you're going to play in Miami, mm -hmm. and uh, you have future shows in the United States. Mm -hmm. Do you plan to come back maybe next year? Um, actually, this is my fourth tour of the US. It's, uh, it's funny that I'm coming to Miami for the first time. Tell you honestly, I would like to take a break next year. I'm, I'm working on a movie which would start from September onwards. It's uh, like you, you can say a, a small diversion from uh, what I've been doing. I've been making music for the last 10 years now and uh, uh, it's only recently that I've realized that I always wanted to act. I always wanted to be, uh, uh, say, a big screen artist. So um, I'd say, no, I wouldn't want to come next year, but um, but yes, next time when I want to come here, I want to come here with <clears throat> something which is like unseen, totally different from what I've been doing. So you would, uh, I, I know your fans will keep waiting for you, no mm. matter how long you keep them there. How are you going to, are you going to be devoted to your uh, movie career next year? Or is yes. something that you're going to try? To yes, uh, it's, it's a big... Uh, a step that I'm, I'm, I'm to take. I mean, I, I don't know. Um, I mean, what, what, what's going to happen? It's like um, uh, jumping into deep waters. It could, uh, it could turn out good for me, or maybe it could, uh, it could fire back as a, as a, as a bad uh, idea. Uh, we have uh, our time is uh, ending, so. I thank you very much for being with us today. I know you're, you're very tired from the concert last night, but you're going to give all your energy in tonight's concert and the future ones. Do you want to say anything to your fans? Yeah, I mean, uh, it's their support is uh, our, uh, our uh, biggest asset. And uh, uh, I, I, we, got, we get a lot of letters uh, from the U.S. and, uh, you know, uh, appreciating our work. Uh, what I would like to tell them is that pretty soon they'll have us um, totally on the internet, you know, easily accessible, um, the vital signs songs, the vital signs uh, uh, photographs and, uh, you know, shots from the concerts and all the, uh, um, uh, the itinerary and everything.